Hey there, this is Dr. Pan recording from Tucson, Arizona. Today we're taking the mystery out of uh, simplifying radicals. Simplifying radical is kind of like eating a pizza. I don't know about you, I like the sausages on the pizza. Okay, so um, pizza. So basically, you're picking what you like to have. And here's how we write pizza in Chinese. Okay, so think of simplifying radical as eating a pizza. You're going to pick the things you like the most. And what do we like in simplifying radicals? We love perfect squares. Okay, so let's write this one out. I have 5 times 25. I love 25. That's kind of like the sausages on my pizza here. Remember the pizza. And I'm going to take each one of them apart because when you're doing multiplication and radical, you can actually split them up. So each one of them have their own house. That's how we write house. Okay. They carry their own house here. And then radical 5 is not a perfect square. So let's say that's a pepperoni. I don't like pepperoni. I'm going to leave it alone because it's not perfect square. This one is a perfect square and it becomes 5. And there's nothing I can do with the radical B. It's another pepperoni. Okay, so when I simplify it out, I have 5 radical 5 times b. All right, that's how we do it. Got it? Good. Send you a list of requests for Chinese characters to my math channel, and next time I'll try to work it into a math video to make it fun. Don't forget to vote, like this video. Till next time, have a confident day.